Welcome to the Finances production by Regina Archie, Erica Brewer, Cynthia Brooks, and Dana Vines. Finances, the science of management of money and other assets. The goals and functions of financial management consist of financial analysis, planning, forecasting, and operating in financial leverage. Accounting consists of income statements, balance statements, and cash flow statements. Economics provides a structure for decision making such as risk analysis, pricing theory through supply and demand relationships, and comparative return analysis. Economics provides the broad picture of the economic environment in which the company makes continual decisions. Financial managers has to understand the institutional structure of the Federal Reserve System. The financial manager has to know how to interpret and use the accounting statements in allocating a firm's financial resources to generate the best return for the long run. Income statement is the major device used for measuring the profitability of a firm over a period of time. The income statement is also known as the statement of profit and loss. The bottom line of the statement is income less expenses. If income is more than your expense, there is a profit. If expenses are more than income, then there is a net loss. Balance sheets indicate what the firm owns, assets, and how the assets are financed in the form of liabilities or ownership interest and stockholders. The proof of the balance sheet balancing of assets equals liabilities plus equity. Statement of cash flows shows the ins and outs of cash during the reporting period. The statement of cash flows is the combining of income, state, and balance sheet together to show cash sources used for the period. Organizations that utilize finance function are sole proprietorship, partnerships, and corporations. Gross domestic product is the total market value of all goods and services produced in the borders of a nation during a specified period. Disposal income is income that is left after an individual has paid taxes and can be used for spending and saving. Industrial production is a monthly report that tracks the total outputs from nation's factories, mines, and utilities. Unemployment is the state of being unemployed. Inflation is the phenomenon of increased prices with the passage of time. Interest rates, the rates which are charged or paid for the use of money, Interest rates are expressed as an annual percentage of the principal. Taxes are the sum of money demanded by the government for its support or for specific facilities or services levied upon income, property, and sales. Capital structure is the study of the relative importance of debt and equity. Inflation is the increase in prices that is a key variable in financial decisions. Disinflation is the slowing down of price increases. The effects of inflation and disinflation have an impact on financial forecasting, the required rates of return for capital budgeting decision, and the cost of capital which are quite significant for financial managers to make important decisions. The financial management task consists of allocate, the allocation of funds to current and fixed assets, obtaining the best mix of financing alternatives and developing an appropriate dividend policy within the context of a firm's objectives. A financial manager task is to perform day-to-day -day functions such as infrequent utilization of capital markets to acquire new funds. The daily activities of the financial management includes credit management, inventory control, and the receipt and disbursement of funds. Fewer routine functions include the sale of stocks and bonds and the establishment of capital budgeting and dividend plans. The goal of the financial manager is to maximize shareholder wealth. Thank you for viewing Finances by Regina Archie, Cynthia Brooks, Erica Brewer, and Dana Vines.